Hey guys, and welcome back to another campaign challenge where we go for the new achievements in the Definitive Edition. And our challenge for this one is going to be in Pax Mongolia, or Pax Mongolica. Apparently the name's changed. But we need to defeat the Hungarians, who are now the Magyars instead of the Teutons, before Super Tai arrives. And I think we have 40 minutes to do that, so let's go. Only one power stands in our way. France and the kingdoms beyond are beaten from decades of crusades. If we break Eastern Europe, then it is likely that all of Western Europe will surrender. But to break the East, we must defeat Hungary. Hungary possesses the most formidable cavalry in all of Europe. They have not only the strength of European armor, but their horses are cousins to our own, having drifted in from across the Russian steppes. The Saho River that separates us from the army of Hungary is frozen, so we will be unable to deploy boats. Instead, the battle will be won or lost over who controls the bridge. Sobotai is coming with reinforcements. If we can survive the charge of the Hungarian knights until Sobotai arrives, then we can hope to take the bridge. Much rests on this simple bridge. If we capture the Saho crossing, we capture Hungary. If Hungary falls, so falls Europe. With Europe and Asia under Mongol control, our conquest of the world will be complete and final. Lord o all right, so we need to destroy all the town centers and castles. No longer need to defeat them and survive until Supertai arrives. 125 population limit, and we can use our saboteurs. And let's see, what are they going to build? Because they're new now, um... Heavy cavalry, skirmishers, scorpions, and battering rams. So a combination of mangodai and camels will probably work for us we then. We are in Imperial Age already, okay? Um... Arrives. He will be here okay, we'll animals. probably need more... Town centers for purposes of training units. And we'll come down here. And I would also like a lumber camp. Um, actually, we don't get the final upgrade, so we don't actually need that lumber camp. Uh, let's maybe get you... Take our sheep under the RTC. And try to upgrade our Mangudai. And work from a position of upgraded Mangudai. Oh, we will need Parthian tactics. And we'll see what we can do to hold that bridge. And just kind of use these towers to debate enemy units while we build up. We will have... So we have 40 minutes to defeat them. I think we can do that. Shouldn't be that challenging. Okay, we'll get the sheep. And we'll need to get some villagers going. And we'll split up the sheep between these two town centers and get the villages more evenly distributed there. Okay, and we'll start progressing towards another town center. Uh, maybe back if we can get it on that stone will be nice. Um, okay, capture that sheep for me, please. Don't let don't let them steal sheep from me. Hey, you got both those TCs running. Let's maybe look for some more food sources. Try to gather some more sheep if we can. Just spread out the scouts. See if the map's changed at all. Doesn't look like they're attacking us yet. Or oh, there we go. Crossbow. Let's pick them off. But they had no, just normal make die, not elite. Okay, we're definitely going to need to move on to farms soon. We don't have a mill. Means we can't turn on the auto queue, unfortunately. Oh well. It scares me that the bridge is purple, because then I can't see when units are moving across it in the minimap. Okay, it doesn't look like we really have much in the way of uh, hunt resources. Maybe just a few more sheep we could find. Oh, look at this beautiful destroyed town. There's some nice eye candy added to this map. And we'll start adding in farms. At least they now go and build the farms instead of staying on their previous resources. That was annoying when they... And the command queues didn't task them to the farms until they finished like mining whatever they were mining. And here's our little secret where we would cut with the siege onagers later. 
But I don't think we have time for that in researching Siege on it, because I think we're just going to have to go for the bridge. Alright, they still haven't attacked us, and we are on hard. It's about time we start adding in that next TC, maybe just one or two more farms. Yeah, I think we're sustaining production now. You guys go there. And I don't know if we have TC room back here. I would like a TC on that stone. Or maybe one on that gold. Actually, I think that... Oh, there's deer there. How did I not see those deer earlier? Those deer will be quite useful. Especially if we TC near them. Uh, great charge. One crossbowman. Oh, and we should have ballistics already. And we have explored basically all of this side. Let's get a mining camp. Actually, no, it's TC time. On this gold here. And now we... Three TCs, I think that's all we'll need on this pop. Oh, hello, trebuchet. Are you ready to die to Elite Mangadai? And we'll need the Husser upgrade, maybe? But I'm thinking if they're... We'll have to see what units they make. We might be able to go just with Mangadai. If they're... Let's see, trading Cavalier, though, we might want some Heavy Camel. And I think we want to start using these towers to help us. We'll need... Oh, they have Magyar Husser? Uh, yeah, definitely we'll probably want some camels. Try to abuse pathfinding as much as we can here. Okay, that's going fairly well. Dodge those scorpion shots. Especially with Mangudai. Go for them. And just kind of jump those two scorpions there. Perfect. And take out the rams. And we'll start working on Mangudai upgrades. We will need Bracer and everything, and we've spent 10 minutes now. I don't know if we're doing this fast enough. Subutai should be here in 30 minutes. No, take your time, I Take your time. I don't know if we'll have time for all of the Mangudai upgrades. But what we should probably do is get up another castle and start mining stone. We'll try to go maybe forward castles and siege workshops, and try to get out rams and trebs, and back them up with some Angadai and camels. And it's gonna be so conscription will be nice because it'll let us do our upgrades faster. Okay, we're on that stone now. And we have a surplus of food right now, but that's just because we had those deer that just finished. And we'll keep the houses coming up. And I think we'll be good on villagers. We, we used this 125 Mongol pop from all those uh, Tamerlane campaigns. I don't know how many more vills we'll need after that, and I think we just want to focus on upgrades. Uh, Siege Ram is probably one of the more important ones, and so is Bracer. I don't want to just rush those towers with my Vangudai until I'm confident that I can uh, knock them down. Am I building a blacksmith? That's why I just told the Vil to build a blacksmith and forgot. Oh, 
Oh, well, you guys here can start building siege workshops and a castle. Uh, we need more wood. But we don't need all of you on stone now. But one more castle will probably be nice. And you will do Elite Mangadai. There we go. And with Elite Mangadai, we should be good, hopefully. We're gonna need a lot of food for Siege Ram and Drill. I don't know if we can afford Drill, but we're going to try for it because it's fun. Okay. No more eco upgrades, no, we'll just auto the farm queue. Yeah, so the only thing, if they're only sending Cavalier, I don't think we need Camels. I think we can survive with just Mangudai. And that castle, when it goes up, she can be the rest of my pop space. Oh, I guess I can delete houses with the Nomads tech. And yeah, alright. Just do that so you're doing something. Actually, no, we'll get the next Siege Workshop up first. And now we go for Siege Ram and Drill. Yeah, I think just playing with Mangudai should be sufficient for us. Especially when it comes to killing Scorpions, like Mangudai and Rams. Oh, it's time for another castle. We don't need all that stone, we're gonna need gold. Um, there's gold there that I'm gonna want you guys to mine. And drill isn't that bad, we just need a bit more gold, and we're probably gonna need a market at some point to try to balance our economy. Okay, so next up on our priority list is going to be drill and siege ram. Come on, gold, I need drill. More gold, please. And get a market so I can sell stuff for gold. And let's use these saboteurs, actually. Uh, not close to drill yet. And drill almost? No, where's that market? There you go. I'm gonna send you guys forward, and we'll see how many of these we need to uh, kill those towers. I don't think they're particularly useful. It's like a OP petard. Is there a gate down here that we can kill with another tower? Alright. Okay, now it's just about massing up siege rams fast enough to kill stuff. And maybe a university would be a good thing. Oh, we still need Racer. And we will need Parthian Tactics. And we want to actually start building up across the river. Okay, I think we're actually starting to get this now. Oh, there's a castle, which we hadn't seen. We'll go straight for the castle for siege rams. Okay, we're about halfway done with our time now. And we're just going to spam out rams, and I think this is enough... Hopefully this will be enough Mangudai that we can hold with it them. Oh, skirmishers though. I don't like I don't like the set of skirmishers. And I don't like Magyar Husser attacking my ram. Alright, Rams, go for... We are losing a lot of Mangudai there. And we also lost all those villagers. Okay, maybe we need more units than just Mangudai. 
Well, I think we just gotta keep pushing now. Oh, there's a ton more Mangadai. What are you doing back there? Oh, okay, Ram. That's not my Ram. Let's just keep the Mangadai coming in and get that castle up eventually. Let's try to keep the siege taken out so we can protect our rams. Keep the rams moving in. Where are those villagers that are idle? Bring you down here. Try to get more rams forward. Okay, let's go rams. Take out these gates so we can get to that tower. Okay. I think we've kind of stemmed the flow. Oh, they're using villages to attack the rams. I was saying, I think we've kind of stemmed the flow of their army. But we need to find where their TCs and stuff are. And hopefully that becomes more clear once we break down this gate. We have more idols. Let's go chop wood for now. All right, yes, go, go, go. All right, we can take out that extra gate. Why not? It's blocking our path. Take out that bombard tower. And let's see, what do we have in here? We need to find castles and TCs. Well, there's another castle. How much is it? We don't have spies, do we? We can take out their gold miners there. <laughs> Kill the villagers attacking the rams. All right, I think, I think we got this. Okay, right, so what we're gonna do? We're gonna build a few more siege workshops in here, and maybe oh, we need chemistry. Haven't done that yet. And I think now it's time maybe we want to delete some... We're not actually building any food units, and we've done our research here, so we can delete the food bills. And just have more pop space for Mangadai and Rams. And we can also just be, um, build a castle right on top of theirs. There we go. Place it right on top of that destruction animation. All right, now we have to search around and try to find where the other castles are and where the other TCs are. And we have 15 minutes to do this. Okay, go. Go for the TC, you speedy rams. And we'll start sending some Mega Die down there. Some stuff coming from stables. Okay, right, uh, we don't need to worry about killing villagers. I think we just need their town centers and castles. So, do you have any other castles like over here? Spread out the Mangadai to look for them. Uh, maybe just take out those stables just for purposes of keeping the rams alive. Okay, looks like we've gone everything on that side of the base that we would need. We just explore that way. And keep the rams coming. Oh, there's a bombard tower. Rams, go for the bombard tower. Such is the fate of the hunter. Oh, we got him. Okay. And all who would oppose the tribes of Mongolia. And we still have a good eleven something minutes remaining. Alright, GG. Let's go look at that map. So Supertai, we don't even need you to arrive. I guess you arrive over here and maybe those cliffs disappear at some point, but uh we don't need to last that long. We don't need to see the bridge explode. All we need is some good Mangudai and Siege Rams. Now, even without zero frame delay, they're still overpowered. Uh, anyway, let's go check out the ending cutscene. Nothing stands between us and the Atlantic Ocean. The Mongol Empire comprises two whole continents. Europe and Asia belong to the hordes. Every place we have entered has changed forever with our passing. Russia, once filled with quarreling city-states, much like the old Mongol tribes, will forever be melded into a single gigantic empire. 
Genghis Khan forged the largest empire ever created in the life of one man. His body was carried back to the river Onon, where the legendary Blue Wolf and Fallow Doe once lived. He was buried in the ground, and a thousand horsemen rode over the site to disguise it. Genghis Khan's final resting place was devoured by the steppes. My people cherish the legend that their great ruler will one day return to lead his horsemen to another bloody victory. Okay, so we took out the new Magyars and the Magyar Hussar. Elite Mang and I were pretty effective at that. So guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll try to find if there's any more achievements that look interesting from the campaigns. I'll try to do them too. And I'll see you guys next time.